In this video, we're going to show you how to clean coin mechanisms. There's various different types of mechs. You've got the smaller type mechs, which work exactly the same way, but just on a smaller scale. Open them up and you've got the sensing section of the mech. And this is the bit you need to focus on when you're cleaning the mech. Similarly, in the larger mechs, when you press the reject, you'll see how it opens up. Be careful not to pull them back too far. But again, it's these areas here which we'll look to clean when cleaning the mech. And with a microcoin SP mech, it's a case of pulling up and then you should be able to pull open. You can see here this mech, lots of dirt in it. And this one, you just clean the whole area. So when cleaning the mech, it's uh, important not to just spray inside the mech because there's various different sensors, coils, and you don't want to get them wet, um, it's going to cause some damage. So just spray onto whatever you're going to use to clean the mech with, something that's lint-free. Um, get it nice and uh, like a, a baby wipe sort of uh, wetness to it, and then open up the mech. And you just want to clean everywhere that the, uh, the coin's going to travel. And then once you've done that, get a bit of cloth which is dry. And do the same until it's fully dry. On the larger type mechs, uh, well most mechs, you've got this area here which often gets neglected. As the coins roll through here, dirt uh, tends to sort of build up on here. And one of the things the mech measures is the diameter of the coin. So if you've got a large build up of dirt along here, it's going to make the coin uh, basically outside of the parameters because it's going to see it as being larger than it actually is. So it's important to just also clean here, sort of get your nail in there and really sort of give it a good clean in here. And do exactly the same as well with going around here. But be careful, what I'm doing is I'm guard, I'm making sure I'm not able just to bend this back because it will quite easily snap if you do actually just sort of, if you just have it like this and just put the pressure on it. So make sure you sort of feel how far it can go back, hold it a bit, uh, forward of that and then just go around and do exactly the same as what I just done and give that a good clean. Exactly the same with these type mechs. So here we're just going to clean this section here, this part, this part here and on this mech it would just be a case of going over the whole thing and clean absolutely every part of it. Anywhere you can see any sort of dust build up and just keep on doing that until you're not getting anything on the cloth and obviously make sure you dry it afterwards and that should really improve the reliability and acceptance of a coin mechanism.